Hello, welcome back to part 2 of Revelation Online Leveling. This is going to be mostly combat in this video, so hopefully that's what you're looking for. Not as much story. In case you missed the last video, we did make it up to level 32, and we are in a new area. And this is from Closed Beta Test 3. So I hope you enjoy this Gunslinger Leveling, and let's get right to it. I love flying in this game. It's awesome. I haven't really taken a look at this area much yet, so, but it's really pretty. Alright, back to Namika we go. All the components are in place, sister. My friends help me a lot. It's possible. It's possible for all of them to come to. Where is the Guardian Demon Slayer? The ritual is about to begin. Forget him, let's go. Wait, sister. And then they run away. I'm here. Punctuality is a virtue of demon slayers like me. You, sir, are too punctual. Glad to see you again, Akuda. You're right on time. Quest complete. Is it possible for my friends to receive the Black Empress's blessing, sister? Sure, but be aware that those who destroy the ritual will be punished most severely. No exceptions. Okay, well, I'm ready to be punished most severely. Everyone in this game walks really slow. They walk so slow. The ceremony is ready to begin, High Priest. Please lead us to the altar, High Priest. Those of you who watched my previous Gunslinger video will no doubt remember this looks very familiar as the super evil demon of death comes up out of here. Sprinkle the fragrant resin into the wishing pond. Yeah, that can't go wrong. Everyone not of the Abyssal Mob must leave the altar. Hmm. That doesn't look too good. Looks bad. Some big magic shit going on. Do big magic shit, big magic shit. We guardians accept only blessings from the ancestral dragon. You go, Fiona Fox. That's me, I'm Fiona Fox. Receive the baptism of light. I don't know if I'm getting inducted into some weird hokey ritual. The flood of pleasant warmth. And now we go back and talk with Akuda. How did the blessing go? It was indescribably warm and toasting feeling that buoyed the spirit. Could she really be wielding the power of the Black Empress? Probably. What made you treacherous human beings deserving of the Black Empress's blessing? Well, um, those guys are all dead now. Who the heck are you to criticize me? Humph. Oh. In we go, into the big hole in the ground. Enter story mode. That's new. What the hell happened? Let's go check it out. Ophidian is indeed in Tidewater. Are you alright, Namika? I'm fine. Can you help me help out my sister? Oh my god, the sister. What is this place? Ophidian, it's here. All you filth, get out of the altar. This belongs to me and me only. What a sad obsession. What do you know about obsession? Have you been spurned by much by most beloved? I am having such trouble reading this morning. Um, I'm guessing I'm gonna have to fight the scary water dragon thing. Yep, I've gotta fight the scary water dragon thing. Um, I pissed it off. That's bad. Let's drop that spider turret. It's it's really angry at me. actually pretty hard to commentate on combat. Um, so what I'm doing is basically trying to drop my spider turret, put down some damage. Uh, I'm just accidentally just switching to sniper mode accidentally. So don't want to do that in general. So I'm deploying weapons here. I'm attacking. I'm shooting. It looks like we finished the first phase of the battle. Fragments of Memory. In Eventide Bay, he's a force of nature. He's injured my people. Don't press me. I don't know. Enchantress Nurse, she must not live. 
leave. A bunch of dead dark scale. Oh, that's kind of weird. I guess we're seeing a fragment of memory here. So, he got away. Yophidian is still obsessed a millennial later. It would seem the incident chronicle did not happen. He went berserk and left the blessing ceremony awash in blood thousands of years ago. Yet Arden still spared him at wimp. So at least we got to a little bit of combat. Ophidian choosing the ceremony to show himself means he's still obsessed with the past. And out we go of the instanced area, and it looks like we got to save those people at least. That's nice. You use the ceremony as bait, you crazy women. You Oh no, Namika has fainted. Namika is okay. Notify the entire sect and protect Tidewater. I'll go check out the encampment in Lumpery Creek. Please take Namika to Elder Tolo in to Elder Low in Tidewater. So I'm guessing I just have to Yeah, we just have to go back to the town now. This is like a really long side quest. Or maybe the main quest. Hey, I got a level up! Yay! So we took, we're taking Amika to the Elder for some healing. I heard the town is in turmoil because Ophidian is back. Are you alright, Namika? I'm fine, just a bit tired and need some rest. Please, go help the townsfolk. I don't feel safe leaving you here by yourself, especially when the Dark Scales have overran Stone Brom Cove. I have the puppet with Nurse Enchantment to protect me. I'll be alright. You should go now. The village needs you more than I do. Nicely said, Namika. Come, let me take you to your room. Dude. If Ophidian had the guts... Oh, that's Akuda. His voice doesn't sound like that. I imagine Akuda to talk like, you know, um, some guy from a Disney movie. If Ophidian has the guts to show, I'll give him a taste of my Red Lotus Flame. Alright, now we've entered story mode again, which means uh, we're instanced. Uh, we will no longer see other players. You kind of saw a bunch of them blink out of existence there, if you were paying close attention. Here's Akuda back over here. We'll talk to Mr. Akuda. Look, like it's already in a panic. Rumor has it the most powerful demon has come to our village. He loves eating the hearts of babies! Oh no, that sounds like a Ophidian. Could he be back to terrorize Tidewater? I heard that Enchantress Nerf fought him for three days and nights, until he's, but he still got away. Actually, I fought him um, for like four minutes. I have it on video. My curiosity tab is blinking. Learn the art of fishing. Learn to change display modes in world map. Expand back page. Expand package again. Evidently, I can expand my backpack. We're not in the middle of a very intense quest. We're gonna go expand our backpack. Uh, I'm not sure where it's taking us. Doesn't look like it's taking us far, but all right, let's let's not let's not do that. Um, we'll go look at those curiosity pit bits after we finish this uh, main story quest. Here. Um, why am I not using wings, guys? Uh, fly, please. Come inside. Prospect to return to town. Ah, uh, there's someone. I see the quest over here. Here we go. So we're persuading villagers. There's a different villager in a different place. We had to persuade him to move three feet. It's kind of amusing. My helpful little guy there is reminding me that there's a whole world to explore aside from the main story quest. Start by pressing O. Uh, we're kind of in the middle of a story quest right now, though, so... Let's go back to Akuda. If you're running at villagers, it's tougher than slaying demons. Uh, yeah. I'd rather slay demons, actually. I don't understand. We've got this entire safety of the village in our hands. The first priest, Arden, left the village a stone tablet that could be used to initiate an ancient defense portal. I don't understand, but we've got to ensure the safety of the villagers first. The first priest, Arden, left the village a stone tablet that could be used to initiate a defense portal, but it was long lost. It would be near impossible to locate. I can do it, for I should be the most powerful demon slayer ever. Okay. Thanks, Akuda. Good to know you'll be the most powerful demon slayer ever. In case you want to see that event map, that's the event map. Uh, a little bit of work on the kerning needed there, for sure. Uh, that's what the press O is. If you press O, it brings up the, the kind of world event map, so you can see 
What else is going on in the world? Uh, Akuda is staring at a wall. Oh, maybe that's the defense tablet. Investigate the monument. Must be the tablet. Now we must talk with Akuta! I knew there was a trick to this tablet. I'm so impressed with my power of observation. Or, Yeah, that's actually what that says. Thought I read that wrong. There was a noise over there. Go check it out. Oh man, Akuta. What, what are you? Looks like we're heading over here. Akuta somehow beat us here. We are now investigating another monument. Uh oh, cutscene! Some kind of shield, maybe. Oh, it raised something in the center. I sense a strong energy in that direction. Let's follow the light. Yes, following the light is a good idea, usually. Okay, one more monument to investigate. Oh, it's a portal. Active portal. You can tell it's a serious because it's ominous music. Mm, I think there's supposed to be talking going on right now, but I don't hear any talking, so maybe there's some dialogue? It's okay, though. I'm not too upset about that. Okay. Did you see that? I thought I just saw two people. The graceful maiden should be the legendary princess of Arden, but who was that young lad? The enchantment was set by set jointly by both. As I said, Arden couldn't be that powerful. Forget it. I'm just going to handle this right now. The enchantment has taken effect, so Tidewater Village should be safe. Let's go see the Elder. We gotta go see the Elder! Actually, I'm guessing we just have to hang out with Akuda here. He's got the question mark over his head. Yep. Portal's working, Elder. What else can we do for you? You're willing to do more for Tidewater Village than we could ever ask from an outsider. I must thank you on behalf of the fellows of Tidewater. You're too kind. We're only doing our duty as guardians. Winnie and her father sob. What happened to them? They're probably dead if she's crying. Winnie went with her father to catch some fish beach but they haven't come back yet. Guess we're gonna go to the beach. We will rescue them. Hooray. Follow Akuda closely. It's dangerous outside. It's dangerous because of low level trolls? Drop our spider turret. This is a good time for sniper mode. I can hang back here. While Akuda does his thing, I can kind of hang out back here. I really love those, those flying weapon of death things. Hmm. Where, where did Akuda go? Oh man, I don't know if it was because I left Akuda or what? It's like I have to stay right with him. Wow, that's that's frustrating. So I failed that quest because I wasn't right next to Akuda, I guess. All right. Well, I'll uh, I'll stay with him. Let's unmount, and we'll stay right next to Akuda. Not sure how you fail that, but all right, whatever. I got too excited, y'all. I just wanted to go and kill some shit.
seems unfair that I have to stay next to Akuda when he's the one, when they're not attempting to damage him, they're attempting to damage me. Fire turret doing work. It's an ambush. Oh, my spider turret died. It's okay, don't worry, we'll drop another one as soon as we get in this combat. You've come too, brother disciple. This certainly improves our odds of victory. Put those peons through the drills till they drop. Yes, sir. Have you forgotten how the Guardians do things? You don't slay demon with idle something. With life statue like this, you have no chance against demon if you have a hundred lives. Big Brother Disciple, this is my friend Fiona Fox. This is my brother Disciple. Guardian Thunder, Makoto. Hooray? I'm, I'm really confused. That was a very strange quest. <laughs> okay, where did Akuda go? <laughs> uh, this looks like a fort of some type. So one of the things that, that I've noticed, at least, is you'll notice I've gained two levels this, this hour or so of playthrough. Um, I don't know how long this is going to come out to be on, ca on actual edited video, but it's about an hour of recording right now. Oh, nice. We got a new item there. Oh, so if we open our bag, we should be able to see that we got a new receiver. So I thought we did. Or maybe that's the reward for finishing this quest. Yeah, it is. Oop, get a little bit more might, a little bit more attack for that. And now we're going to follow Akuda to wherever we may go. In 58 minutes, we've been in combat like three times, I think. Um, it's definitely not as much combat. What was me? Good to see you, Winnie and Madam. Where's Uncle? One more thing. Huh. Oh, there we go, guys. Uh, I got an unexpected game crash. Um, that was Revelation Online. Uh, unexpected game crash. Unexpected end of video, I guess. So after an hour, uh, I guess we'll do a little wrap-up. After an hour, uh, I spent... Uh, 58 minutes recording, and I gained about two levels. So the level pro progression once you get past level 30 is really much slower. Uh, it takes much longer to level, and it's not a bad thing because it means that there's a lot more end game content to work on. And I'm still enjoying the game immensely. Definitely still enjoying the game immensely. Uh, there's really nothing wrong with it that I can say at the moment, even though it's still a beta product. I except obviously for that particular crash there. That was. That was my own fault. Uh, I mean, it wasn't, but it was. It was. It just happens. Games crash, especially beta games. You know, with nothing I can really do about a beta game like that crashing, and so that's where it goes. That's how life goes when you're in beta. But overall, I'm really enjoying Revelation Online's third beta. Uh, stay tuned. I'm gonna keep making videos. Uh, I'm hoping to get to end game content in the next, uh, in the end of this beta. Hopefully, to get to level 60, so that I can start to get towards more of that end game content. I'll probably do a lot of that off camera, because off camera just makes it um, <laughs> it's a little easier. Because I don't, I don't read the dialogues, so it's a little easier to just do it off camera. Uh, and I just go straight through, and then you know, if I can go, if I can go straight through, I can rush through dialogues. I don't have to spend the time reading them. It goes a lot quicker. I get a lot less time. <laughs> In an hour, I'll be able to to do four or five levels instead of just one. So stay tuned to Kitska YouTube channel for more Revelation Online content, and don't forget to like and subscribe, and leave a comment about if you're hype on Revelation Online or if you think it's just going to be another that passes without anything major.